Now, I wouldn't call road construction therapy, but I would consider playing tennis a form of therapy. Now, where am I going with this? Well, thanks to a little construction, you will soon be able to enjoy some therapeutic tennis on some brand new courts at Howard Avon Park. The original tennis courts at Howard Avon Park were built back in the 1940s. In the early 80s, they were rebuilt, and now, 30 years later, the courts will be completely reconstructed. As part of the construction project, crews will also rebuild Amon Park Drive from Lee Boulevard to the community center. The tennis courts are really heavily used in the Tri-Cities. So there's, we have men's leagues, um, ladies' leagues, um, there's senior leagues that play down there all the time. Um, they're regulars, I mean, as soon as the weather's decent, they're down there. I mean, I'm surprised at the winter time when it's cold, the number of people are still down there playing tennis. A lot of youth use it. I mean, the, the high schools, the middle schools, I think there's some private organizations come down and actually teach lessons. The Recreation Center have programs down there. Um, so it's, it's really good, and with the, the quick start, I think that will just add to the, the possibilities of bringing more youth into involved in tennis. The way we're developing this, the new concept is taken out of the master plan that was done several years ago of Howard Avon Park. And what that called for is the, the courts as they exist now has about a 60 foot paved asphalt area between the two. And about the only thing that's ever used for is our maintenance vehicles, um, a staging area maybe for like when the Allied Arts is there or special activities. Well, what the plan called for and what this new design does is we take that asphalt out. The two tennis courts will then move to the south to fill in that gap and we're creating about a 50 foot space on the north end of the tennis courts adjacent to the restroom that will be a nice sloped turf area. So when you're actually coming down Lee Boulevard as you look off to the right coming into the park where the arch is it won't have a background of a big chain link fence it'll be a, an open space looking through and it'll be a nice turf area. And with the slope of the grass will be a nice spot for when the concession stand is open on Lee Boulevard, um, people will be able to sit on the grass, um, you know, have something to eat, and it'll be, create kind of a nice little viewing area for people watching tennis matches. Construction work on the tennis courts in Amon Park Drive started at the beginning of the month and will last until the end of November. Now, during the duration of the construction project, crews will have both the tennis courts and Amon Park Drive completely closed to the public residents will still be able to access the community center by using Bradley Boulevard. Well, that's all the time we have this month. But before we leave, we need to thank Mike White with Columbia River Journeys for taking us out and showing us the beautiful scenery along the Columbia River. And he actually requested this beautiful day too, so thanks, Mike. Not a problem. Gary and I are gonna kick back, relax, enjoy life, and we hope you do the same. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time on 30, 30 Minutes. minutes. Mike, can I drive the boat? Well, no. Thank you. Hit it, Mike. Let's go.